Hey guys, so I thought today I would do a quick little video about what supplements I take. I asked on Snapchat if any of you guys wanted me to do a video on the supplements I take and why, when, how, and a lot of you said yes, so here I am. So things to note before taking any supplements, you should always check with your doctor. Different people have different conditions or different circumstances where taking supplements taking certain supplements might not be ideal so definitely check with your own doctor before taking any another thing to note is that supplements are not just some magic thing that are going to make you super healthy and super fit you need to have a good diet and exercise for them to work they they're supposed to enhance your diet and exercise they're supplements so if you're just taking them on their own and you're not working out or you're not eating healthy, then there's not really any point. You're not going to see any real benefit from it. So with that being said, let's get started. These are just the ones that I take and when, why, and how I take them. So for me, my number one supplement would be protein. This is the one that I'm taking at the moment. It is the Women's Best Vegan Protein. I have it in... A few flavors but I've just been using the unflavored at the moment um, I was surprised by the taste it tastes actually good especially for vegan protein so why do I use protein well protein is essential for building muscle mass building lean muscle mass protein is what helps your muscles grow I find it difficult to eat enough protein in the day that I like should be eating to build muscle so taking protein supplement definitely helps. I find that if I don't take it, I will just be eating so much more food and like I already eat a lot of food, so I just could not deal. It can be used to help gain muscle. It can also be used to help lose fat. It can make you less hungry throughout the day. It helps preserve muscle. But the most important thing in my opinion is that it helps you build lean muscle and strength. I use this or the whey protein. I used to use the whey protein a lot more. At the moment, this is the one I've been using. So how do I have this? I have my protein a number of times throughout the day, usually about two times, sometimes three. I have two scoops. You should always take it how it um, recommends it on the back. I have two scoops with water straight after I train. Always, 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 always. But I also have it in the morning in mixed in with my oats. Sometimes if I don't have my usual oats for breakfast, I'll have something else and then I'll have just a shake with it because I always want something high in protein in the morning. And then, yeah, definitely straight after my workout, your body absorbs a protein shake faster than food. So it's great to have it straight after you work out when your muscles are really needing a quick energy fix they need that source of protein and then sometimes i'll also have a shake before bed or at like night time i'll have two scoops with water and i just usually do that when i've maybe struggled to eat enough that day if i haven't reached my macros or something like that because you really want your body to have a constant source of protein next is the women's best slim body shake this is protein again but it is more for meal replacements. So this is great if you're after fat loss. I have this one when I am either, if I'm like super hungry in between meals, I'll have one of these. Or if I'm in like a really big rush, I will make a shake. If I have to like rush out the door and I don't have time to grab something to eat or I don't have something prepared, I'll just have a quick shake. And I just have that with water two scoops again i'll also sometimes have the slim body shake after my bigger sessions like leg day because it has a little bit more carbs i like to have a lot of carbs before and after my leg days next is bcaa's which stands for branch chain amino acids they basically prevent loss of muscle mass and as well as keep you hydrated during your workouts and also help you recover faster. I think BCAAs are great. It's just really good to help protein th synthesis. Synthesis? Protein sy pro So basically when you do an intense weight session, you're in a catabolic state and your glycogen stores are being depleted. Your body is under a lot of stress. Branched chain amino acids, they're essentially the building blocks 
of protein and of muscles so that is why taking them before, during or after your workout can be really beneficial in keeping that protein synthesis going. I drink it during my workouts. I have one scoop in water and they taste really good. Some people also have them just whenever throughout the day, but I just have it during my workout. Okay, next is creatine. So women's best haven't had L-glutamine and creatine for that long. So I used to use creatine and I just used like a generic brand. I think it was the one, just one that Reese used to buy from a local shop. And then I stopped using it for ages. I just ran out and didn't be bothered going to get some more. And then Women's Best came out with some. So I've been taking it again for a while now. What creatine done, do, ugh, why can't I speak today? What creatine does is help increase your workout intensity and it helps you, it helps your muscles contract better. So basically it helps you build muscle faster because the more intensity, the better contraction, you're going to um, see resu better results quicker. And it also helps speed up your recovery. So I take creatine either in the morning around the time I have breakfast or I take it right before I train. I just have one scoop with water. Next is L-glutamine. So when you work out, glutamine can often get depleted and glutamine is another one of those building blocks for protein synthesis. So basically it just, again, promotes muscle growth and helps prevent muscle breakdown. But it also has a number of other benefits, like it's really good for your stomach and your immune system and a whole bunch of things like that. The list could go on. So I take one scoop with water straight after I train. I'll either have it just with water or I'll have it in my protein shake. I've been having it in my protein shake lately. Next, pre-workout. So I don't take pre-workout every day. I don't take it every time I train. I don't feel like I need it every time I train. So it basically increases energy and can help increase performance because it has ingredients that increase blood circulation. It can make you t feel a little bit tingly when you take it. That is perfectly normal. I just take it when I am like super tired, but I'm gonna go to the gym. Like I feel like I really need that extra boost. And when I do take it, I just have one scoop in water before I train, like right, like 10 minutes before. A lot of people ask like, do you actually use these products or do you just like promote them and stuff? No, like I use these products every single day and I have for so long so yes I definitely use these products yes they definitely help like I would never tell you guys to go get something that I didn't use or love myself so hope that was helpful and thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you soon